Wait a minute. This isn't Florida. I didn't sign up for the cold. Well, I guess we're here now. So may as well enjoy it. All right, so today we're taking this, well, whatever, this is this is an absolute beast of a truck here. We're going to be taking this beast of a truck as well as a bunch of toys. We got uh, two snowmobiles or sleds, whatever you call them. We got a tracked Yamaha quad, and then we've got another quad here with a plow on the front. That way we can plow out the cabin we're going to be heading out to today, which is just kind of over there in that area. So we're going to be taking this beast across this lake, at least to get onto the trail. Frozen lake, so hopefully it's nice and solid and we can get a cross bond. Also, YouTube says that over 74% of you guys that watch the videos aren't subscribed, so if you guys enjoyed today's video, consider subscribing. Anyway, let's go across the frozen lake. So, first off here, I've got to give a big shout-out to, uh, I believe, Leaf? I'm sorry if I get your name wrong, man, but thank you for sending me this truck that we're using here today. It is not public. I have no idea if you'll be making it public, but, uh, yeah, this is the truck we're going to be using to make the journey, and hopefully we make it across. But I will say, this truck is an absolute beast. It is crazy tall it's kitted out with tracks and uh well you know it probably could use a bigger drop hitch but yeah it should be fine but we're all loaded up here as many as toys as we can get on there we've got on there so hopefully we uh make it across all fine here i think we're gonna have to go off the trail actually today because i've been through here before and i think this trail is it's a little rocky so we're kind of gonna have to do some cutting through trees and stuff i did check the ice before we did go across though and it's nice and solid so we're fine there but uh, once we get out to the cabin, we're going to have to plow it out there because there's it's snowing right now and there's going to be a lot of snow there. So we want to be careful going through here. I mean, we've got an absolute beast of a truck, so we shouldn't have any issues getting up there. But there is no plow trails out here, so it's going to be it's going to be quite the journey. You know, I think for one person, I really don't need this many toys. But I mean, we're going to be out there for a little while. And if one breaks down, we've got another. So I want to be prepared. Yeah, really, this is kind of ridiculous, the amount of toys I've got on here. All right, I got to check my map and see which way we're going here. All right, I believe we are going straight. I've got a GPS location as well as a map here, so I can kind of get a decent idea of where we're going. You can still sort of see the trails. Um, you don't really know you're on a trail until, well, until you slide off and you get stuck or something. I don't think we're going to get stuck. I mean, if we do, we got some stuff to hopefully pull us out. I don't know if it will, but hopefully it does. But I don't think we're going to be getting stuck. Probably should turn my lights on. There we go. Now we're talking. Now it's a little brighter out. So I've only been out to this cabin a few times, so it's going to be kind of an adventure here. I've been out here in the summer. Um, I think I've been out here once in the winter, but that was years ago, so... I'm not really too sure what to expect here. I know the trails can get pretty bad as far as I've been told, so I guess we're going to see. It doesn't help the fact that we're pulling a trailer. I mean, maybe if it had tracks on it, it'd be a little bit better, but uh, I think I think we'll be able to make it. I hope so, at least. But it's definitely going to be an adventure. Also, I do plan to unhook this uh, truck here, and we're definitely going to be having some fun with this. I want to scale some hills and stuff with it. Yeah, you could probably take this thing out into the Arctic, and you'd be fine, honestly. Probably not pulling a trailer, though. I mean, the snow isn't crazy. It's still deep, but it's not crazy deep, so we can still pull the trailer through. But, in fact, I think the trailer is more, it's more dragging than anything <laughs> because the, the drop hitch doesn't go that low. So it's kind of just the uh, two wheels there doing most of the work. All right, so we're approaching our first bridge here. These are pretty solid bridges back here. These are uh, old logging roads, so they built their bridge as well. Crazy that there's no snow on them, though. Hmm, it's a little weird. All right, I think we go this way. I think there's actually, believe it or not, some people that farm out here, which is crazy. I never thought you could farm this far into the woods, but uh, I guess you can. Well, what's this? What is this? Hold on, let me get out of here. What the heck is this? What go? Is this? Oh, okay. So this just must be some sort of a corral deal. I'm not too sure. Well, it's looking like our GPS is telling us we need to go this way. So, oh well, may as well go this way. Looks like just a big open area with some pallets. That's a little weird, huh? Oh, looks like we gotta cross ourselves. Oh shoot! I think we're okay. Um, <laughs> I was not expecting that. I hope I didn't break anything here. The trailer is at quite an angle. Um, all right, let's just let's just get down here. Oh dang! I think the trailer's scraping a bit. <laughs> I was not expecting that. I thought it was. Oh shoot! Yeah, that's quite the drop. Dang! <laughs> Look at this drop. Oh, I hope the trailer's okay. I th I think it is. I hope it is. Well, I know the truck's okay, but. Dang, that was that was quite the drop. I don't see a. Okay, and never mind. I I thought I was. I thought I didn't see a bridge, but there's one right there. All right, so we missed the bridge entirely. Um, GPS. I don't know what it was thinking there, but uh, I wonder if they moved the bridge because that looks like a spot where a bridge would have been maybe. So I wonder if they moved the bridge because uh, that's only slightly annoying and well probably damaging to my truck in some sort of way. Dang, I really hope my truck's good. Um, if it's not, 
we may have some issues because we're, we're kind of a long way out here. We might be doing some walking. No, we got snowmobiles. We're good to go. I got enough fuel and stuff here that we could uh, probably make it back and then some. But I do think we're actually getting decently close here to the uh, cabin. It kind of sits right on a lake slash river deal. It's it's right on the uh, right on the lakeside, so it's really nice. The cabin isn't much, but uh, it is there, so uh, it is better than nothing. But I think it's just up here. Where is it at? Oh yeah, there it is. It's right there. Hey, who the heck left the lights on? Sure as heck wasn't me. Maybe someone's standing there. Nobody's been out here for weeks. Or maybe it's just a glint off my lights. No? There's lights on. It's a little weird. All right, I'm just going to park this right here for now. Hmm, it's weird that there's lights on. All right, so it turns out someone just left the lights on last time they came. A little strange. So I guess I shouldn't say this is like a lake or anything. It's more of just a, a waterfall. Yeah, there's a waterfall right there. This can't be very solid, so I should probably get off of it. But, uh, yeah, this is the cabin right here. Uh, like I said, nothing much, but uh, it will do. Uh, I guess we should probably unload the toys here. I didn't really think about how I was going to get this off, to be honest, because I had a loading ramp back at the house. So this could be this could be a bit of an issue. All right, well, may as well unstrap everything and take it off the trailer. Well, I definitely plan to do some riding, that's for sure. So maybe a little bit later, either tomorrow or something. I do plan to take the uh, truck out, though, just by itself. Because I feel like that'd be some fun. There's some hills and stuff back there that we can go on and stuff. So I definitely plan to have some fun out here. Yeah, I think this uh, quad on tracks is no match for the snow. It should uh, get through about everything we need. wonder how well the sleds are going to do, though. I mean, they're built for it, so I guess we'll see. This, on the other hand, I feel like this is just going to get stuck. That's why I have the snowplow on the front. You know, figure that there's no snow shovel here, and I didn't bring one, but I brought a snowplow, so that should do the job. All right, so my plan is here to offload this very safely without getting anything wrecked. That's kind of the goal here. Man, this truck is... This truck was built very high. Uh, I, I much underestimated the uh, the height of this truck. Let's just say that. All right, well, I'll, I'll see if I can figure out how to get this thing off. You know, just nice and safe without breaking anything. Yep, that's the way we do stuff around here. All right, we got the quad off. Well, not to win. Um, you know what? May as well do some snow plowing here real quick while we're at it. Because I don't have a snow shovel. So, what the heck? There we go. That ought to do the job. Just kind of want to get the steps clean right now. I got the lights on now. That's a little bit better. Now we can actually see. See, this is the way to plow snow. Shovel is too old school for me. No, no, no. This is the way to do it. I should actually plow it a little spot for the trailer too eventually. All right, I think we've finally got somewhat of a decent spot here for the trailer. It's probably a little longer than it needs to be, but whatever, it'll work. Uh, may as well just park the uh, quad right here for now. I think it's already getting late. I didn't realize. Let me check the time. Oh, shoot, it's pretty late already. Okay, well, I don't know how much uh, riding we're going to get done today. We might do some tomorrow instead. But you know what the best part is about down here? Is there's cell service. There's actual cell service. Nah, I'm just kidding. That's definitely not the uh, best part about being here. That's just the... Uh, that's just a little plus, but uh, we got the trailer here now. I guess I probably should unhook it real quick. There we go. All right, that's done. All right, well, it's getting pretty late here, and, uh, well, the snow's coming down, so I think I might uh, do some riding tomorrow, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, so it's about 8 in the morning here. I've uh, had my coffee, and I've had my breakfast here, so I think we're going to go out and do some riding today. The snow is still coming down a little bit, but not too bad, so I think it should be perfect for uh, taking a little ride today, so... Guess we'll just jump in the truck here. I do want to take this truck out first because it's kind of the coolest thing we've got. All right, let's hit some trails. Well, more roads than trails, I guess, but same, same. All right, so apparently there's this uh, kind of mountain deal that we can go up. So I'm going to see if I can find that here. I've got it marked here on the GPS, so we're going to see if we can go up there. I think we are at the uh, th the mountain here. This is this has got to be it here, so I'm just going to stop my vehicle here real quick. Actually, probably shut it. Ah, you know what? We're not going to shut it off. Oh, so this is be the uh, cell tower we got here. Can we get up here with the truck? Ah, uh, you know what? I'll probably just walk up here. Man, that's kind of cool. You can see everything from here. Can I see the cabin? I want to see if I can see the cabin. Uh, can I see the cabin? I don't think I can. How about if I... Can I climb up the tower? Can I? Oh, oh, I thought I could for a second. Oh, that's really disappointing. I thought I could climb up the tower. That would have been so fun. Oh, we made it up here. There was no struggle for the truck at all. We didn't even slip at all. We got up that no problem. Should we go down the mountain that way? I don't think so. I don't think so. No, no, we're not going to do that. Oh, can we see where we started from? Oh, there's the lake that we started at. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's the place right down there. That's kind of over there is where we started. That's pretty cool. Well, is that lettering right there? <laughs> there's lettering right there. I think that's that's the thing on the map. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right. Well, now that we've checked out all of that, I think we're going to head back here. I'm going to go uh, most likely have some lunch, I'm going to say. And then uh, we're probably going to end up heading out and uh, doing some snowmobiling. It should be fun. 
I don't know if we're going to take the quad out today, but uh, if we do have time, I think we will. We're only out here for the weekend, though, so it's not going to be too long. we got to head back tomorrow morning. And the days here are pretty short, considering it's winter, so the days are really short, and it gets dark really fast. And the last thing I want to do is be stuck out in the dark out here, so I don't like to go too far. I mean, maybe if I had someone else with me, but since I'm by myself, I'm going to say I should probably just stick to uh, walking distance that I can at least get back before, before the night. All right, so here's the old creek bed here. We kind of cut across here to get to the trail, to the main trail, which is right here. You can see our tracks. Not for long, though, because it is snowing. I think our cabin is just right up here. Oh, got to cut across the creek bed again. And there's the cabin right there. All right, I'm just going to stop this right here. And uh, I'm going to go have some lunch, and then we'll go out riding some sleds. Okay, may as well get these things started here. Up on this. Well, I guess one of them. We don't really need two of them. You can only ride one, unfortunately. Well, I guess it is more river. All right, well, I've let this thing warm up for a little bit here, so I uh, may as well get going. I don't know where we're going to go, though. Okay, I think I kind of know where I'm going, roughly. Um, I can't really say too well I know where I'm going, but I can say somewhat. Okay, come on, turn. Don't be broken on me now. We can kind of go places that we can't with the truck because it's a smaller vehicle, so. Can you even call us the mobile a vehicle? I think you can. Just some Oh, shoot. To some degree. Yep, that was a big jump. Well, it wasn't really a jump. It was more a fall. It was a big drop-off. Got to watch out for trees here. I'm going to slam right into one if I'm not careful. I'd be curious to see the uh, guy's place that farms these uh, mountains, I guess. Well, not mountains. He farms in the, the more the valleys, I guess. Because I saw some fields out here, so it'd be cool to see his farm. I'd just be curious what that operation is like. Having to clear out trees just for farmland. Yeah, here's a field right here. Oh, hold on. That must be the place. I don't really want to go on his land here if I can help it. Uh, you know what? We'll just go, on the, just go down here. I think this is frozen here. I hope it is at least. If not, we'll do. We'll uh, be. We'll be doing. We'll turn this thing into a jet ski in no time. Yeah, as long as we go fast enough, we'll be fine. Just head down here. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. He's got a full operation. Oh, he does cattle. That's. Th those are cattle barns. Hope I'm not going right into his. Pro oh yeah, I am. <laughs> going right into his property. I'm sorry. I don't mean to disturb you. Oh, got a duck. We're gonna turn around. I'm not. I'm not dealing with that. Turn around here. Oh boy, we're sliding. Huh. That's pretty cool. That's just kind of cool. That they got a whole operation back here. Well, I think I'm going to head back, and uh, I'll see you guys back at the cabin. All right, we are back. May as well park this thing back where it was here. Come on. There we go. Anyway, guys, it's going to be the end of the episode for today. If you did enjoy, smash that like button. Also, if you're new, consider subscribing. I'm probably just going to hang out here for the rest of the day. So i got to head back tomorrow, maybe do some ice fishing. You never know. Anyway, hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next one.